we were searching for a toaster oven that was big enough to cook a full-size pizza. The one we came across, that even though it's 20-some years old, is the Euro Pro X, the 1500 watt version that is bigger and, as you can see, holds a full-size pizza. When we received it from eBay, we see why the original people were getting rid of it because the temperature was way off. That's why they got rid of it. So I decided to go into it and adjust the thermostat and I'll show you how you can adjust the mechanical thermostats on most any toaster oven if they're out of calibration. Now the first thing to do is get yourself a oven thermostat, one that you know is accurate and you place it in the middle of the oven as shown. And then I set the temperature control to 360, which is pretty much a standard temperature. And I set the function to convection bake. And after getting some readings, I could see that definitely it was way low, over 75 degrees. So here is how you can adjust those mechanical thermostats. On the Euro Pro, you have to remove the bottom feet and a bunch of screws in the back and on the bottom, and you slide the cover back just a little bit to access the mechanical thermostat. Now, to adjust the mechanical thermostat, you need a pair of needle nose pliers, and you reach in and grab the adjusting arm, and as you can see, if you move it to the right, you increase the temperature. If you move it to the left, you decrease the temperature. And it only takes just the slightest bend to affect quite a, a change. So it's kind of Kentucky windage. You have to keep working it until you get it close. Now the one secret is you cannot read the actual temperature in the oven correctly if you have the cover partially off the way you would have it to adjust the thermostat. So what you have to do is after you make a, a slight bend, either increasing or decreasing, you have to slide the cover back over because as the elements heat up, the inside gets warm and you won't get a correct reading because the thermostat will be cooled by the outside air. So you slide the cover back on, turn it on, give it a chance to get up to temperature, see where it is, unplug it, cool it down, pull the cover back, make another little adjustment, rinse and repeat until you get it as close as you can get it. I got it within 10 degrees of my 360. Then what you do is turn it all the way down and read it, turn it all the way up and read it. In this case, I cannot get the, the maximum that they say I'm going to get of 450. I get about 430, at least on my temperature gauge that's in the oven. But that is good enough so with it all put back together we now have a countertop toaster oven that is big enough to put a pizza in i know the euro pros are old but as long as they still function they work as good as a new one